Hello, hello, hello everyone and welcome back to Aviators. We're going to be checking out the level Baptism of Fire today. If you haven't checked out the first video, Hangar, right here, go and look at that. This game is pretty history, um, history thick, so it's about the Polish Air Force after the fall of Poland in World War II. So the first episode, Hangar, we got a, a bomber ready and let's see what Baptism of Fire has to offer us. All right, we got the spinning circle. Baptism of fire here again. Yatiga, wake up. Yatiga, what's wrong with you? Are you hit? Talk to me. No, we look like we're okay. Fine. We're in a rear gun, maybe? Forward Stop gun? Can't back. tell. Oh, we got a plane coming in. On Rounds on target. Didn't get lit up too badly. At least the person didn't. Plane might have taken a couple hits. Looks like we got a couple planes downrange. We'll put our gun to work. Okay, we got three planes. One down. Ooh, this turret does not have that great of a turning radius. Let's get some more bullets on this guy. He's going to come right at us. We should be able to get him. Now, their guy went just right to left. Where'd he go? All right, it says accelerate. I'm holding shift, but we are not doing much with the accelerate. All right, where'd he go? Looks like he's coming in below us. Defend the plane from the back turret. There he is. All right, a couple rounds on target here. Got him. Nice. Oh, of course it jammed. How convenient. And we got, looks like one more that just went over top. Because we're jammed there, lady. We don't have a Rounds coming in target. Uh, what are we supposed to do here? Okay, we're launching a flare. Assuming anyone's around. Alright, shout out. Alright, no one's going to see that, probably. But, you know, we tried. Um, let's grab that info there. I saw one there. We'll grab both of those. Uh, oh, this did not go well last time. Okay, so let's go... Alright, and then hold. Oops, mess that up. Hold. Hold. Do do. Hold. Uh, hold. Alright. Oh, so these are quick. Hold. Hold. Alright, bump, bump, bump. Alright, I know nothing about Morse code, but I know that part of it. Alright, looks like we're going to the front gun now. Our plane just flew off on our left side. Let's get this gun here. Here we go. Come on. Get in my turning radius. Uh, uh, come on. Shots out. Shots out. He's coming down. Nope. He's like almost there. Maybe 30% health. While he comes back around, let's reload. There he is. Alright, we got this guy. There we go. Shots out and down. Another one coming in from our right as well. Why? <laughs> Everything's jamming. God, we're getting shot up pretty good. What was that? Okay, nice. Uh, Spitfire? Hell yeah. Hmm. They've uh, edited the voice acting here a little bit. I think the engine's hit. Yachka, go to the upper turret and check how bad it is. All right, upper turret here. Let's climb on up. Ooh, hey, right over top. Right over top of us. Woof. Ooh, and there's a fire. Hey, baptism of fire. Okay, we got that. Alright, let's grab this fire extinguisher here. I'm going as quick as I can. A preenie fire extinguisher? This is not what we normally have. Is this like an air blaster? Alright, that fire is out. Let's get this fire. That fire is out. And we should be able to get this one here in a second. Nice. Alright, let's get back to that rear gun. No, where are we going? I thought we were going to lose the plane. We need to land. We're running out of fuel. Ladies, it's thick with crowds over Dover. Time to go. Okay, Thank wants us to go back up front. Looking after us. Damn, the gear is not extending. The rear strut must be gone. The control light is off. Yaja, we need your help, or we'll be landing on our tail. God, it's Bristol already. We need to hurry. Go to the rear and get the wheel loose. All right, we got it with an axe and some sort of what is this? Oh, a pipe maybe. Grab this pipe here. Beautiful. Alright, and we'll go get that rear wheel down here. Get around the mid turret or the top turret, whatever they called it. And let's do this. Wiggle this out. 
Use the axe to pry it open and a good kick maybe? No, we're just gonna pry it all the way out. There we go, rear gear down. We're ready to land. I did it. We've got the rear wheel. Not a moment too soon, we're about to land. And they said flying for the ATU was boring like driving a taxi. Hmm. So, coffee, tea? How about some Porto wine, Lieutenant? A large glass of Porto wine. Oh, another plane saved. Maybe for the guys flying back home. But I've had enough of the Halifaxes for now. Hmm. Tell me about it. All right, well, let's put this bird down. Uh, okay, we're going to black screen. Aircraft salvaged by the ATA are returning to Royal Air Force service. They are used for bombing throughout German occupied Europe. They also fly to occupy Poland, carrying the silent unseen couriers and weapons needed by the home army. But not even their passengers or pilots know how much these planes will soon be needed. Ah, there we go. There's the end of the episode. So we'll go ahead and pause once this loads so we don't lose too much. And what's this next episode? Fistula? Yeah, we'll pause right here. Thank you so much for coming out and watching this video. If you've enjoyed it, don't forget to like it and subscribe to Tooth and Scrubs Gaming so you'll get all this great aviator content on time in an orderly fashion. As always, leave me a comment on down below. Love to hear everyone's feedback. Let, it, let me know what I can do to make a better video for you. I'd love to hear that. Uh, and if you don't want to do any of that, that's okay too, but we'll see you in the next video.